Hi folks, Canadian Prepper here. So I wanna just do a quick video today, an update on the bug out roll system. No theatrics, I'm gonna cut right to the chase. I wanna first off thank all the people who've supported this campaign and helping me getting this project off the ground thus far with your purchases of the bug out roll, which I assure you is going to make it to you as soon as humanly possible. Now we've had a few hiccups along the way I've left this task pretty much in the hands of my manufacturer who has had some problems on the labor end of things. I'm not sure what's going on with that, but basically we're backed up a couple weeks from our uh, expected shipping date, which was supposed to be the end of this month. So I apologize for that. We're still sending out the orders in the order of secession as we got them. So you can rest assured that your roll is gonna be sent out as soon as possible. But one of the other reasons why it's taking a bit longer than expected is because we've made a few enhancements along the way because when you get this I want it to be 100% I don't want to do anything half-assed I want to make sure the product that you get because you're paying good money for it is gonna last a long time one of the biggest changes we've done is we've changed this to a 30 gauge vinyl now I know you can't see it on the screen and you're not really gonna be able to, to understand the difference because you'll probably never see the 20 gauge vinyl because we're probably not gonna go back to that. This is just a much thicker, more resilient vinyl. It's UV resistant, it's cold crack proof, it's just a much hardier, more industrial strength type vinyl, which is hopefully gonna stand the test of time. Another thing we've done here is we've double stitched the center section, so that's just gonna provide more security there now remember uh, when we first did this roll there was not even a, a strip of fabric there at all there was just one strip of thread so it just shows you how much we're progressing in terms of making this a more durable product we've extended the length of the receiving velcro patch there so it's just gonna give you more security for the items you put in here we've put an elastic tension band here so that the items you put in here are gonna be more secure. We still got the heavy duty YKK zippers on the hard use Cordera section, as well as the medium duty YKK zippers on the vinyl sections, just to reduce weight. Just so you know, the overall weight is uh, 1.25 kilograms, which is akin to 2.75 pounds. So it's a heavy unit, but weight is quality. And so that should give you a sense of the quality of the materials that are used here and actually the 30 gauge vinyl surprisingly didn't add a lot more weight than i uh, expected i thought it would be a, a bit heavier i thought it might take it to three pounds but only 2.75 so not bad we have extended the flap length that's going to allow you to stuff the roll a bit larger and still have that wrap around encapsulating security and this is a double-sided flap so this is actually two helpings of the material one on each side. I didn't want, it just wasn't aesthetic, but it wasn't also perhaps as functional to just have this bareback here on this side. Uh, so we decided to double it up here for the flaps. You get a bit more protection, a bit more water resistance. Water beads right off this 1000 Denier Cordera. And of course you get the embroidered patch. You can't see it, but this is actually embroidered right into the material. Now when you wrap it all up, this will marginally stick out. It's actually a really nice logo, it looks really nice. You do have a handle on it now, which is good. We're probably gonna reinforce that stitching. That will be one of the final recommendations I make, but it is, looks like it's, they've went back and forth there a few times. So it's definitely gonna be secure enough to hold. You still got your four D rings. Everything's just been reinforced upon reinforced. So when you do finally get your roll, it's gonna look great. And I'm gonna show you, I don't have them here today, but the other colors, I'm gonna do a video in the next couple days just to give you a sense of what those look like and they look pretty cool. So, you know, if you haven't bought one yet, you may wanna to wait to check those out. We're also gonna probably be offering other colors in the future. We'll cross that bridge when we get there. One other innovation that we're probably gonna add and I know we're gonna add is once we get this going and once we built up some surplus inventory, we're gonna to start to offer different types of sections. So we're considering other sections like this that have different compartment arrays and different vinyl sections as well. So what we might even offer in the future is greater compartmentalization in the vinyl section. 
And those of course are gonna be modular sections that we sell. So this four section is always gonna be the same for the most part, maybe until you know future versions somewhere. But your system will always be compatible with future modular versions that we offer. So like I said, stay tuned for that because we'll probably be offering a lot of those in the future. But honestly, the hard to use section, the extra vinyl section, that's pretty much the meat and potatoes of this. There's so much stitching that goes into this product. You can't really see it on the camera, but there's just a lot of work that goes into each and every one of these. So realistically right now, we're looking at about a two week delay in terms of our expected ship time. So the orders will be shipped out in order of succession as we receive them. So if you placed your order, uh, you know, right on April 1st, right when this was released, then you'll be among the first to receive your roll and you'll be sent out a uh, tracking number and all the rest. If you have any questions whatsoever, you can message me at bugoutroll at hotmail.com. I try to respond as quickly as possible. I'm just getting swamped with emails lately. So I just wanted to clarify, you know, the reasons as to why the shipping has been delayed. But uh, make no mistake that when you do get your roll product, you're gonna be getting a quality made product that was manufactured in North America by North Americans who take pride in their work. So that said, thank you for watching. Please continue to support the Canadian Prepper channel by liking, commenting, and subscribing. I'm out.